Back here in the Bay Area, we're learning more about a deadly stabbing at Sonoma State University. KPIX 5's Jessica Flores found out that the suspect and the victim were not students. As students head into finals week here at Sonoma State University, police continue to investigate that deadly stabbing. But right now, investigators say there is no threat to the public. The deadly stabbing happened Sunday evening, the start of what should have been a quiet finals week on campus. This is not a random act. It appears that everybody was acquaintances. So I want to assure the, the campus community that there's no further threat to uh, the students here. Police say the suspect is 19-year-old Tyler J. Bratton from Santa Rosa. Investigators say he stabbed to death a 26-year-old Sonoma County man inside this apartment at the Savignon Village Student Housing. Neither the victim or the suspect are students at the university. We think they're visiting friends here. Police quickly arrested the suspect, this morning transporting him to Sonoma County Jail. One Sonoma State student told us he thought he saw the suspect after the attack. I heard some screaming, and I ran outside to see what was going on, because it was obvious like it wasn't joking around. I looked around, and there was a, a guy. He started walking down the stairs, and I looked at him, and he came around, and then I saw his, the right side of him, and he was, uh, his arm was all bloody, and he was carrying a knife. Police say they have recovered a knife and are still working on uncovering what happened before the stabbing. It was a rumor. It felt like it was, you know, definitely a fake thing that could have just got tossed around anywhere. But knowing that it did happen and getting a confirmation way later in the night was uh, upsetting. The university says there are grief counselors available to any students who need them. At Sonoma State University, I'm Jessica Flores, KPIX 5.